here. So today I'm going to talk about Eric Inferno, written by Tiffany Patterson. It's a BWWM romance novel. This is Fireman Meets Bartender. So Eric is a fireman that um, that went to Harvard, has a degree in finance and so sociology, and then Angela, she also um, went to business school. She has an associate's in something. I forgot what it was, but she does have a degree as well. But to end up being a bar, uh, she ended up owning a bar. So now Eric, um, with all his accolades, because he's smart, he was supposed to be his um, father's right hand person. His father works for Tennyson, and Tennyson, we also. Okay. Anyway, his father works for Tennyson, and ten his father's a CFO for Tennyson, and he won. His father wanted um, Eric to follow in his footsteps. Oh, first of all, uh, also Eric is also Asian. He's um Asian. Yeah, he's mixed. He's Korean. He's Korean, and um, Angela is black. I'm sorry, I forgot to say that. Anyway. As I said, his father was the CFO for Tennyson, and he wanted Eric to follow his footstep. However, Eric didn't have the passion and the love that his father had. He always wanted to be a firefighter. He remembered that from when he was little. So his father and mother were very disappointed when he quit um, working at Tennyson um, to go work to um, become um, a firefighter, right? So anyway, it's been that's been seven years now. They still have like a little animosity and a little like oh you disobey me I spent all that money for you to go to an Ivy League school and you couldn't like at least stick it out so he's like it wasn't my passion it wasn't my love I couldn't do it anyway he met Angela at a bar Angela as I said owned a bar and she's also she's has firefighter in her family her father was a firefighter and her brother is a firefighter her Angela father passed away uh, he he and his wife were killed in a, crane, a plane crash two years ago, and Angela was still like recovering from it. She's still mourning. Now she lives in their home that he left for her, and um, she's trying to become something for herself, right? So Eric and Angela met, and they went basically. They went on few flirtatious um, interaction together at the bar. Then he finally. Um, man enough to ask her out. They went on a few dates and that's when their love story begins. And let me it's very rom romantic, emotional at some point because in the book you get to read that um her fear of him being a firefighter even though she had it in her blood because of her father and her brothers and she still know the drop the the pain and the risk that comes with it and so does his parents that's why his parents really didn't want him to be a firefighter they wanted him to have a 95 but that just wasn't in his blood and um they have a lot of like little love scruffle lovers quarrel nothing much and all that emotional romance and drama that comes with it is all there in the book. This book is really, really good. It's not it's not like a series, it's a novella. And um, as I was trying to not to say before, the Tennyson, I think it's Jake Tennyson, and I think he is um, he's in one of our what's the name previous books, but I might be wrong, so forgive me on that. But I think I heard that name before in one of the books. I just don't remember exactly which book. Anyway, it works out that um, that they start becoming a really they have a relationship. They have a little love squirrel, as I said. They have a little drama here and there. The book is really interesting. I'm trying not to give away too much spoilers because some of the authors book that I done they said I gave away too much spoilers. So I'm trying not to give away too much spoilers, but. The book is really, really good. I think you guys will love it. It's a novella, as I said. It's very short. It's not long, maybe a hundred something pages. You could probably read it in a couple hours. And um, you get to meet the, char the other characters in the book, the other firemen, like Don, Corey, uh, what's his name? Chase, Caesar? I don't remember. There's another one. And um, then you, met, you get to meet her friend, which is Stephanie, and her best friend, Janice. So they're all in the book, and you all see how they interact with each other, how their chemistry is. And it's really, really good. You guys will love it. It's a romance novel. Check it out. It's called Eric's Inferno. It's loving, kind, it's caring, compassionate, and it's a BWWM. Remember, um, Eric is Asian. 
Asian American, I would say, because he was born here. So he's Asian American and Angela's black. All right, guys, let me know what you think. Bye.